the email the email of Bo Dominican York. I was filming for about a minute and a half and realized I didn't have my new mic on. It's probably recording off the uh, camera mic. I'm not doing it. Anyway, got some figures. If you look up top, I do have Shipwreck. That was for Christmas. And that is the Shipwreck box. I still haven't opened up his accessories. I just have Shipwreck out right now. You see he did come with some accessories, and this is from the Classified series, so I'm happy that my wife got me two figures from the Classified series. The next one being Snake Eyes. Snake Eyes and Optimus Prime, probably my two greatest uh, hero figures in cartoons from my era. But, she also got me... This speed bike, the Trooper, and this was one of the first Star Wars toys that I ever had. Uh, I remember originally going to see Return of the Jedi, which this originally debuted in, uh, back in the 80s with my mom. It was a big deal, Return of the Jedi 3D, that was a big deal. But, I had gotten to the unboxing and realized I didn't have the mic. So here it is, that's the Scout Trooper. The bike isn't here, it fell out. Ooh, it comes with a stand. It comes with a stand. That's perfect. And I am going to keep the box. So I'm going to have to take the figure out, but I would like to keep the figure dead stock. But I think I'm going to take the figure out. What do you think, Meow Meow? I know you're the figure uh, aficionado. Shout out to Meow Meow the Hill. You guys need to check him out. He usually comes on at midnight to 1 a.m. Let's open up. Let's try to leave this showing. You guys can see that. And the speed bike. Uh -oh. It's a little more detailed than I remember from the 80s. Got the speed bike. That's the cockpit. He's gonna stand there. Oh wait, does that go down? Yeah, that goes down. Okay, I knew something looked different. All right. And then these something allowed it to stand up. I wonder if it's gonna be on this. Oh yeah. He might be able to float. Oh, with the stand, he's going to be able to be riding it mid-flight. That's perfect. All right, so that's one. Actually, we got to move him because I got to get the snake eyes. All right, so this one again. It is from the classified series, so it's going to match the um, shipwreck up there. Let's open this bad boy up. I, I know you can hear it. I'm watching G.I. Joe. I hope I don't get clapped for that. I won't finish unboxing everything here. I mean, opening it up. But I at least wanted to show it off. Make the video quick. There is Mr. Snake Eyes. And his trusty companion, which I forgot the name of. Do they say? Timber. I should have remembered that. Good heavens. Now the articulation is pretty decent on these. And these are bigger than the 1980s figures, for sure. There's Shipwreck. So he does... Have his arms move that way, straighten, bend, and then his wrists. Torso. That's a different one. And then also it can adjust legs. 
don't know how to show off figures. But I like the construction and the quality on these. Super satisfied, super happy with it. And um, this is going to be nice. There's always a way to make this. Oh, you can't see it. But I've got a uh, shipwreck standing. And again, snake eyes. And if you guys look way up there, look at where my finger's pointing. Let's see if I could do it. Right there. There's snake eyes, storm shadow, and behind them two, Kakashi Sensei and Naruto. But uh, right now, the star of the show snake eyes, timber, and of course, shipwreck. And really, the speed bike and stormtrooper. So that is sick. Shout out to the wife for the presents. Thank you so much. And check this out. Just in case you thought Uncle Bo was a good. Thank you for being my uncle. Hey. I'll get into the trinkets another time when I show all the what's up here. If you guys want to. But uh, again, thank you for hanging out with your Uncle Bo. Que yo te bendiga.